Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to my channel. The Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said in one of our hadith, he said, "I swear by Allah, there is a prayer, there is a dua that a single believer will not make or supplicate through this dua, except Allah Almighty will give him for what he is asking for." One of the companion by name, he is Saad. Bin Abi Waqqas, radiyallahu ta'ala an. One day he went, he went inside the masjid, and he saw one of the another companion, the third Khalifa, Uthman bin Affan, in the masjid. So he said, "Salam alaykum, ya Uthman." Uthman didn't reply to salam. So Saad got little shocked and surprised. That how come I'm saying salam to Uthman? And Uthman is not replying the salam, so he went to Khalifa Umar bin Al Khattab, and he said, "Ya Umar, Ya Amir al Mu'minin, is anything happening in Islam?" So Umar said, "What happened?" He said, "I said salam to Uthman bin Affan, but Uthman did not reply to my salam. What's happening?" So Umar he sent someone to bring Uthman. So Uthman رضي الله تعالى عنه when he came then he said how come Saad the uncle of prophets sing salam to you and you're not replying the salam he said he didn't say wallahi he swore he said he didn't say any salam Saad said wallahi i said salam Uthman said wallahi he didn't say salam so how come subhanallah of course they're not lying so then Uthman said one minute just a moment I remember I was sitting in the masjid, and you came inside the masjid, but I didn't hear anything that you're saying. I was very sad; my mind was very busy, and I couldn't hear. So the other two companions, Umar and Saad, they said, "What happened, Yah Uthman?" He said, "One of the days I was sitting with Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. So he's talking back then when he was with Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He said, 'What happened?'" The Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "I swear by Allah, the one God Almighty, the one who is holding my soul in His hand. There is a dua, there is a supplication, there is a prayer. If you do this prayer, Allah Almighty will give you whatever that you are making the prayer for." And he was just about to say this dua, but what happened? One of the Arabi, one of the Bedouin. He came in, and the Bedouin we know that till today that you know they are lack of manners. So the Sahaba, out of respect, they start feel shy, and they start leaving one by one and going, you know, on the other side. So this Bedouin can take his time with the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He took some time, the Bedouin, and he left. The Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam immediately after him he stood up and he walked. So Uthman said he went home and we couldn't hear the dua again from him. So I'm really sad. Umar, Amir al-Mu'minin at that time, he said, "Wallahi, I was with you at that time, and I feel also sad that I didn't hear that dua." So they all became very sad. At that moment, Saad said, "I will tell you this dua." So they got surprised. Saad, how do you know this dua? He said, "When Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam went to the home, I start following him one by one, by one step by step, until I reached at home. I knocked the door. Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam came out, and he said, 'Ya Rasulullah, you were saying a dua and you swear about a dua, but you left. So what is the dua?'" So Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said that the dua is la ilaha illa ant subhanaka inni kuntu min az-zalimin the dua of Yunus alayhi salam and it's mentioned in the Quran Yunus alayhi salam he said this dua when he was in the belly of the whale not only that the ulama said he was into the three darkness The first darkness was the belly of the whale. The second darkness was the darkness of the night. 
The third darkness was the darkness of the ocean. Yunus Alayhislam and the Messenger Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam told us the key. That key will open the doors for you. So imagine if you're in deadly situation, Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala can take you out from it. So if you need success, if you need a job, if you need a wife, if you need children, if you need successful life, if you need peaceful life, whatever you are looking for in this dunya, wallah you make this dua and Allah will give you for sure. It's a golden key or a magic key that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and his messenger give it to you. So you can open the doors of the skies from this dua. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will sure will accept it. Thank you for watching. Please like and share this video as much as possible. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you once again.